This video today is going to be on the American Grip. I'm going to give you a close-up slow-mo as well as talk about it in general. So the American Grip is like this. You can find the American Grip by going basically halfway between the French Grip, which lines up with the axis of your arm and your thumb is directly on top, and the German Grip, which does not line up with the axis of your arm. You can kind of see that it's at a weird angle here. And your wrist is on top, your thumb is to the side. So this is the German grip, this is the French grip, American grip is sort of in between. Your hand is turned from the German grip toward the French side, but not all the way. Also, you line up the stick with your arm axis as you would in the French grip. The reason for this is because you want to be able to use both the wrist technique you had from the German grip and the finger technique you have from the French grip at the same time. So if you're in this sort of halfway position with the stick lined up, as you can see down the axis of your arm, uh, then you can play uh, pure wrist strokes. You can also play pure finger strokes, or you can play wrist and finger combination. So that's really versatile. You're going to notice that when you're playing finger strokes in this position, you're going to close up the gap between your thumb and forefinger to give a better brace for that fulcrum to work against. If you're playing wrist strokes from this American grip, um, you can open that gap back up and just relax your hand a little bit more. When you're playing both at the same time, you sort of have to hedge towards the closed finger alignment. And I'll show this from another angle as well. So from this angle, here is your French grip, here is your German grip, your American grip is somewhat in between. You can see I use the tips of my fingers on the stick. Um, thumb sort of to the side, but not all the way in German. When I'm playing finger strokes, I close off this gap here, just play strokes with my finger. When I'm playing wrist strokes only, I can open that gap up. If I play both at the same time, I'll close that gap back down again. Uh, the stick's lining up with the axis of my arm. So we'll do a slow-mo. Pure finger strokes. wrist strokes. Combination wrist and finger strokes. <laughs> 